Hello, welcome to Horror of Spice, where everything's nice. I'm Horror of Spice. And I'm Mrs. Horror of Spice. And today is the beginnings of Giallo-thon, where we're going to do Giallo Essentials, white, and then after we finish white, we're going to do black. Well, uh, first is the night Evelyn came out of the grave. And we decided to pair that with Diablo Jalapeno Hot Sauce. Here, let me show you. All right. So, this is the Giallo out of slip cover. Pause that if you would like to read it. Let me move my thumb. There's the movies, and the first one we're going to see Evelyn came out of the grave with Diablo hot sauce, Filipino hot sauce. Now, Mrs. Hora Spice, uh, what special thing did you do with the hot sauce? Well, I made burgers and fries, and what I did is I did a one-to-one -one ratio between mayonnaise and the hot sauce, to, and put it on the burger sauce, put it on the burgers, and I put it on a side dip for dipping the fries in. Yep. So here's her final product on the dip. There's her burger and fries. There's mine. Well, come back and uh, see us in a minute. And we'll uh, discuss what we thought of the night Evelyn came out of the grave. As well as Diablo hot sauce. Catch you then. Hey everybody, welcome back. Horror of Spice here. And this is Horror of Spice. Uh, this is very nice. Uh, the pepper uh, has a powerful kick. And it's long lasting on the tongue. Yeah, I I liked it. Um, oh, I, I would give it uh, four out of five peppers because uh, um, I didn't uh, f uh, feel comfortable f with how long the the burn lasts. Yeah, I would I would give it um, honestly, you know, about a three out of five peppers. I, I wasn't. Um, it. It was a good tasting one, and it was, but it was quite burny, and I think the one to one ratio was like too concentrated, and I think more of like a two parts mayonnaise and one part hot sauce would have probably done better for it, to be honest. Otherwise, it's a little overpowering. So if you if you decide to get this, um, make sure you mix it with something. Um, by the way, Diablo jalapeno, um, Filipino sauce says you're going to need another bottle with all natural ingredients, no added preservatives, and eight flavor profile. Unlike anything other, our spicy ginger garlic sauce captures my dad's... Uh, Civilian cooking in a bottle. Filipino hot sauce uh, conceived and manufactured in the U.S. Uh, shake well, refrigerate after opening, and keep close. Uh, our round comfort heat makes uh, every uh, bite hit better. So that's what the company has to say. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is the night, um, Evelyn came out of the grave. This is the, uh, new slip cover that they did for, uh, this box set. This is the original slip cover. Uh, which one do you prefer? This one or this one? That one. Okay.
Uh, ours came with an advertisement to uh, aeroplayer.com. Uh, those with the uh, Roku sticks and um, 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 Android users, I know I don't. I'm not an iPhone user, so I won't know about iPhone. But Android users uh, also can uh, download Aero. Uh, to your phone and uh, your Roku stick. Um, naturally, you can also do it on your computer. Um, I don't remember right off the top of my head how much it is, but I'm going to say $25, just just to be safe, uh, a month for uh, uh, Arrow's uh, streaming service. And uh, a lot of their films, uh, not their whole catalog but a lot of their films are are, are on there um, we enjoy the horror the sci-fi uh, the cult exploitation um, things of that sort uh, the night Evelyn came out of the grave at the height of Italian giallo boom in the early 1970s scores of filmmakers turned their hand to crafting their own unique takes on these Lurid murder mystery thrillers. In the night that Evelyn came out of the grave, director Emilio P. Uh, Margarella, uh, the Red Queen kills seven times, medals in Giallo's trademark twisty without storytelling, um, whodunit storytelling, uh, with gothic chills. Concocted a gripping horror thriller hybrid. Uh, troubled aristocrat Alan Cunningham, Anthony Stephan, Django the Bastard, haunted by the death of his first love Evelyn, tries to move on by marrying a seductive Gladys Marina uh, Malfatti. All the colors in the of the dark uh, marital bliss is short-lived however as various relatives meet untimely and gruesome deaths promoting speculation and the vengeance Evelyn has risen from the grave uh, this comes with a 2d restoration uh, original camera negative uh, it comes in Italian with English subtitles as well as uh, uh, English uh, sub soundtracks as well um, it's got audio commentary by Troy Hothrath Howrar um, exclusive introduction by Erica Blanc Interview with critic Stephen Thrower. The night Erica came out of the grave. Exclusive interview with Erica Blanc. Uh, the Whip and the Body. Uh, archival interview with Erica Blanc. Uh, still Rising from the Grave. Archival interview with production designer Lorenzo Bardella, Bardelli. Um, original Italian theater uh, trailer. Reversible sleeve with original and newly commissioned artwork by Gladys uh, Ranks. This is 103 minutes long. And this is a Blu-ray. What's your thoughts on it, Mrs. Horror Spice? Well, I love this movie. I'm not going to give away anything because I really think you should watch it. It's a really good movie, and there's so many twists and turns. I I couldn't even really keep up at, at first, but once you start getting into it, and it just, you know, the ending, the ending's worth it in it all. Uh, I love this movie from through and through. I wasn't bored. There was always something going on and always something happening. And it just... It's, it's a great murder mystery. It, it's great if um, you and your friends want to do a, like a murder mystery night at home. Um, 
this is a great whodunit. And you can vote on who did it and see from there if you got it right or not. And as I said, many twists and turns and you'll love it. Uh, there is uh, little splashes of evidence to show you who done it uh, in the end uh, throughout the film. But uh, it's very subtle. You know, uh, it's not uh, over the top. Uh, the person isn't flagrant with their behaviors uh, until the very end. And then all of a sudden, you see how mentally disturbed a person is. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's uh, very uh, psycho-esque. I don't know what came first, this or psycho. But uh, you can tell that uh, one was inspired by the other. Um, I'd give this a 5 out of 5 peppers. Definitely mm -hmm. go check this out. Um, as far as the Giallo Essentials, well, the first one was a big hit, so uh, come back next week when we'll check out the more of the, the Giallo Essentials White. And that particular movie will be The Iguana with the Tongue of Fire. <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoy the hot sauce, too. Uh, if this is your first <laughs> time with us, hit that subscribe button. Uh, if you're still with the flow of the video, comment down below, Evelyn. Um, we love you guys. We appreciate you. Well, from Horror of Spice. And Mrs. Horror of Spice. Y'all stay creepy now. Bye. Bye.